Hello, my name is Brant Schalk. I'm with UAS eLearning in Distance Education. We're going to go through the process of configuring EduRoam. The significance of EduRoam is that you automatically connect to the University of Alaska wireless network when in range. This may make it a little more convenient for you as opposed to having to connect to UAlaska and authenticate every time. To start the process, you want to make sure we have wired connection or wireless connection. You'll then want to go to the URL https colon forward slash forward slash nah.alaska.edu forward slash eduroam. Once you're there, you'll see the drop down menu and the version of OS we're currently running is 10.6. So as you can see, it's specific to the version. You'll want to then download the PKCS file. And I'll, I'll usually select download linked file. And then I'll drag that file over to the desktop. Now you're going to want to download the certificate the same way download link certificate and drag that over close this minimize the web page and going you're going to start by double clicking the root CA keychain access window will open you're going to need to select always trust next step is to double click the UA the file with your UA username at Alaska edu file. You'll want to authenticate with your MAC password here in order to make changes to your keychain access window. To enter the password for this, it's going to be just your UA username. So for my password here, I'm going to type in BK Shulk. Click OK. As you can see, that's entered in there now as a certificate. With that finished, you can lock this up and close keychain access. Now you'll want to go up to the wireless network connection window, open network preferences. Go down to the Advanced button and go over to 802.1x button. Click down at the plus sign or Add and Add User Profile. The user profile, I'm going to just type in Eduroam. Click OK. For your username, you'll want your UA username at alaska.edu. Bypass the password. You will not need to put that in at the moment. Uncheck TTLS and PEAP. Check TLS. Go down to Wireless Network and select EduRoam. Now go back up to TLS and select Configure. We're going to select the certificate we created earlier. It's already highlighted. Select Continue. Click OK. Make sure security type is WPA2 Enterprise. Click Apply. The changes that you made are going to need to be authenticated with your password to the Mac. Go ahead and close out of that. Now we're going to want to try and attempt to join that network. So we're going to select Join Other Network. We 
we'll type in the network name edurow in the drop down it is WPA2 Enterprise your username is going to be your UA username at alaska.edu and you're going to bypass the password entry area select join asking you if you want to authenticate to the network at your own. Click continue. Once again you have to authenticate at the Mac level to allow the changes. As you can see it's going to take a minute to authenticate properly to the at your own wireless. Looks like we have a connection established. You can quickly tell that by browsing to another network connection. As you can see, it looks like we were able to get that worked out. Thanks for watching, and I hope this works for you.